Uh, hi, Mike Williamson here from Monster Energy Kawasaki. Uh, here to show you today a little graphic installation. What we have here today is some of our decor graphics with the new Flow technology that has a bubble-free application to it. <clears throat> it's got little air channels so that when you apply it, there's no air bubbles, you're able to push them out. So uh, let's get started. Currently, uh, one of the easier ways for me to uh, install graphics is I like to take a, a piece of paper out of the center. So I just lightly take a razor blade and just run it across the back of the paper so that you can remove the center. So you could work one side at a time. One of the first things I do before I put any graphics on, you wanna make sure the surface is clean, just a little contact cleaner. Something that'll get the oil or fingerprints off and dry up. Just clean it real good. Get all the glue off. So you got a clean surface. You know, obviously this panel's new, so it's not so bad. Um, like I said before, I cut out the paper. So when I go to apply it, I'll just use, find, find something to line up where there's a, there's a line or there's, for on this side panel, there's two holes. So I kind of just match up an edge, get the front hole lined up, kind of touch the center and then get to the back hole so that you kind of have it all lined up and then you can press down the middle and it should stay there. So then that just allows you to work one side at a time instead of trying to work with a big piece. So I just bend it back, peel the whole thing off, just hold it with this hand and then just begin to apply it. Just kind of using your finger, just like that. All that's stuck down, then you're, you still have this and you still have your paper, so you're able to work the other side. And mainly, I just usually cut the paper out for the big pieces. Obviously, the small ones you can control a little bit better, but it's hard to put a whole side panel sticker on or a shroud sticker with peeling all the, all the paper off. go. Okay, on smaller pieces like this, um, I usually don't cut the paper. Um, you kind of just hold it up there. And on most graphics, if you already have this part on, <clears throat> I always wait to put the center piece on so that you could line up any kind of lines they put in the graphic. So pieces like this, I just peel the whole paper off because they're a little bit easier to work with. And obviously the shape of the air box helps, but I just find some points, you know, and try to line them up as best you can. You can kind of just stick it down and then just kind of work from the center. Center out. Like I said, the easier ones are a little bit, a little easier to work with and just make sure you push them all down. Stick real good. I don't recommend using heat usually because some of the adhesives or anything don't don't really like the heat and later on they'll they'll tend to peel back up but obviously I don't recommend doing it in the cold either I make sure it's at least room temperature or whatever and uh, there you go she's on So that's my version of putting on graphics. I know there's other ways of doing it. Um, that's a simple way of doing it. Check out decorvisuals.com for other info and all the graphics.